The Chengdu J-36 is a speculative designation given by military analysts to a tri-jet tailless diamond double delta winged aircraft under development by the Chengdu Aircraft Corporation. As part of China's sixth generation aircraft development program, the heavy stealth aircraft is envisioned for multiple mission sets, including air superiority, strike, interception, and command and control of aircraft teaming operations. Today in this video, we will explain the general concept of its weapon payload configuration based on publicly available information, focusing on its design for internal weapon carriage to maintain stealth, and the types of munitions it is expected to carry. This information is provided at a safe, educational level for reference purposes only. The J-36 is designed with internal weapons bays to maintain its stealth profile, which is a common characteristic of advanced stealth aircraft. This internal storage capability allows the aircraft to carry a substantial payload for various missions without compromising its low radar visibility. The design includes a large central internal weapons bay, complemented by smaller side bays. The J-36 features a large central internal weapons bay, estimated to be approximately 7.6 meters long. This bay is designed to accommodate long-range missiles such as a PL-17, and potentially substantial air-to-ground munitions or cruise missiles. The PL-17 air-to-air missiles are estimated to have a reach exceeding 400 to 500 kilometers. In addition to the central bay, the J-36 also incorporates smaller side bays. These side bays are intended for munitions like the PL-12 air-to-air or YJ-12 anti-ship missiles. This configuration allows for flexibility in mission roles, prioritizing either air superiority or ground strike missions. The side bays can also carry short-range air-to-air missiles for self-defense while preserving frontal stealth. Capacity The internal configuration allows the J-36 to carry a wide range of weapons, including both small missiles and large standoff weapons. This internal armament stowage is crucial for maintaining its stealth profile during missions. Anticipated Munitions The J-36 is expected to carry a versatile and powerful payload of munitions within its internal bays. Air-to-air -air Missiles PL-17 The primary weapons bay is capable of housing ultra-long-range PL-17 beyond visual range air-to-air -air missiles. These missiles are designed to engage enemy aircraft at extended ranges. The anticipated loadout includes four PL-15 long-range radar-guided air-to-air missiles. Side bays can accommodate PL-12 air-to-air missiles. The J-36 is expected to carry two YJ-12 supersonic anti-ship missiles, which enhance its maritime strike capabilities. The J-36 large internal weapons bay and diverse weapon carrying capacity underscores potential as a multi-role aircraft capable of both air superiority and precision strike missions. The J-36, with its design characteristics, is well suited for a variety of ground strike missions, primarily focusing on deep strike capabilities, precision attacks, and operating in contested environments while maintaining stealth. Its ability to carry a significant internal payload and coordinate with other assets positions it as a versatile platform for future warfare. Deep Strike Missions The J-36 is particularly designed for deep strike missions, allowing it to penetrate heavily defended airspace to target critical infrastructure and strategic assets far behind enemy lines. This capability is supported by its estimated combat radius of approximately 3,000 kilometers, suggesting its suitability for long-range operations, precision strike, and heavy payloads. The aircraft's large internal weapons bays are designed to accommodate a diverse array of weapons, including land attack munitions, without compromising its stealth profile. This allows for the delivery of significant payloads with high precision. The side-by-side -side cockpit similar to the Russian Su-34 fighter bomber. Further supports a strike or battle manager role, implying coordination of attacks and electronic warfare tasks. Command and control of unmanned systems. The J-36 Advanced Avionics Suite is expected to include an active electronically scanned array radar, electro-optical targeting systems, advanced electronic warfare capabilities, and sensor fusion technologies. 
These systems enable the aircraft to function as a command and control node, coordinating unmanned systems and maintaining situational awareness in highly contested environments. This makes it ideal for directing drone swarms and air-to-ground strikes, operating as an aerial destroyer rather than just a traditional fighter. Anti-ship operations. In addition to land-based targets, the J-36 is expected to carry YJ-12 supersonic anti-ship missiles within its internal bays. This capability allows it to conduct anti-ship operations, posing a threat to naval assets. Its long range also makes it a critical asset in regions like the Indo-Pacific, where operational reach is paramount for maritime engagements, operating in contested environments. Stealth is a core design philosophy of the J-36, with features such as radar-absorbing materials, flush-mounted sensors, internal weapons bays, and recessed exhaust to reduce its infrared signature. Its optimized airframe shaping minimizes radar returns from all angles, enabling it to operate with reduced risk in hostile environments. This allows the J-36 to execute ground strike missions even when facing sophisticated enemy air defenses. In conclusion, the J-36 is envisioned to perform ground strike missions that involve long-range penetration, precision targeting of strategic assets, coordination of unmanned aerial vehicles, and maritime attack capabilities, all while leveraging its advanced stealth features to operate effectively in highly contested airspace.